Hey guys, thank you for joining another episode of Mukbang with your host, Dong Diggity. Today I'm going to eat a food called Gyudon. And Tenjang Chige. Technically, this will be like Korean version of miso. And this is Japanese dish called Gyudon, which is beef over rice with onsen tamago, which is Kind of like American version will be poached egg. So yeah, let's eat. Mm. It tastes very, very sweet. Especially if you pop the eggs. Oh my goodness. You could definitely serve it with, um, usually in Japan they do put a raw egg on top. Usually if you go to a Japanese restaurant, they will have gyudon. Not that expensive. And they're relatively cheap to make. <clears throat> Some water. Because <sighs> usually when they get a thin sliced beef and they simmer it in a fish and seaweed stock and they use mirin which is a sweet rice um, wine. and a bit of soy sauce. Very simple. And this is called gyudon, because gyu is beef in Japanese. And don. Don is a, a short term for donburi, which is a literally means bowl.
So those who normally are familiar with Japanese food, there's many food that ends with don, which has a rice in them. I feel like eel over rice, that's called unagi don. Mm. Salmon, sake don. But usually they serve this in lunchtime. I, um, I'm not 100% sure, but I think I'm sure you could find this in the dinner time too. But most of the time in Japanese restaurant, I only saw them at lunchtime. Super random, but let's say you're really close with your neighbor. Whether it's like an apartment or a house. And your neighbor's like mom or whoever, elder, contacts you and say, Hey, I'm hoping to see if you could share your password for Wi-Fi. And what's the most polite way of saying no, you know? I'll totally say like if you were willing to pay half of it, hell, I don't mind, but I'm just trying to get it for free, you know? Definitely with the egg, it makes it like 10 times better. Good. Yeah. Okay. Are you? Like honestly, I hate the fact that like they're asking for something hard, you know, like um, share your password for your Wi-Fi. It's not like, you know, it's kind of worn out because we use it. All that kind of crap. Like the fact that you're asking me for a favor, but really you gotta say it like that.
and try to be respectful, you know. Bitch, no. And after, it's just gonna ruin like the whole relationship. Oh man. That was so good. <laughs>